Dr. Edinger, uh, good morning. So everybody should be up now, Greg. Great. <clears throat> Can't hear her yet, but um, all right. Yeah, it looks like we've got all of our experts here and fantastic. I can't hear you, Dr. Edinger, yet. I'm not sure if you can hear us. Oh, I think your audio is still connecting. There we go. Hi, Larry. Can you hear us? Yeah. Fantastic. Okay. Well, I will go ahead and get started. Um, good morning and good afternoon. We've got folks actually from uh, both Europe and uh, the U.S. on the call today. I really appreciate this group uh, making themselves available. Um, I'm going to talk briefly about Bexin in a moment. I think you've all been introduced to us as a company via Jeff or myself or, or someone else. Um, but we are at a stage where we're now graduating to wanting to really work more closely with you, the clinicians, uh, to get your input, to get your feedback, to understand your patients better um, and uh, how we might be able to best help them. So we'll be doing that today with our lead therapy, BB106. Um, and we'll talk a little bit more about that. But um, let me just say again, thank you. This is not a formal kickoff to maybe a scientific advisory board, uh, but it is our first formal advisory board where we do want to, again, interact with, uh, with all of you. And Sheldon, are you able to maybe just put the agenda up and we can um, just review that briefly? Fantastic. Um, really quick piece of um, administrative we are recording this session. I think we let you know that. I hope that's acceptable to everybody. If it isn't, I don't know, text Jeff or I right now. Um, but we want to do that not to share this externally. We are not going to do that. Uh, but just to make sure we get the notes correct and, and get your feedback correctly. Uh, so I'm going to make it as brief as possible as just sort of an introduction. I think what we'll do is have each physician briefly introduce him or herself and then just our speakers today. Uh, from uh, Bexin and Stevanato and um, uh, Balda, briefly introduce ourselves. And then Jeff will talk a little bit about uh, the drug part of our drug device combination product. Uh, and, and again, also solicit your feedback. And then we've got um, Scott and Christian will also be talking to you and better understanding the patients to the extent so we can um, design the best device to deliver this therapy. Um, so with that, um, I will maybe just, uh, thank you, Sheldon, for the, uh, for the, yeah, for the, um, agenda. Uh, Greg Peterson, uh, co-founder, CEO of Bexon Biomedical. Jeff and I co-founded Bexon about three years ago. Um, it has been, um, an exciting and fun ride so far, but we're in early stages, drug developments, a long cycle. Um, and, and like I say, uh, looking forward to continuing to work with all of you, uh, as we develop these therapies. Uh, Jeff, did you want to introduce yourself? Sure. Um, Jeff Becker, uh, science director at Bexin and, uh, a ketamine practitioner for 15 years, mostly in the context of major depression. Uh, but having seen the pain management, uh, just in the office and, and reporting back from patients really kind of piqued my interest and got deeper into what ketamine can do for pain. And here we are. So. Fantastic. Uh, Christian or Scott, do you guys want to introduce yourself? I would go first, uh, if you don't mind. Christian Riva, nice to meet you all, guys. Uh, I'm a technical development lead on the project uh, that uh, see all, all of us involved, and uh, very happy to be here and to understand your, uh, your answer uh, to, to design a better product. Yeah, my name is Scott Ulrich. I'm uh, on the device development team at Patel. I sit in the human-centric design group. I'm an industrial design lead and human factors researcher. Nice to meet you all. 